The Danel Iron Ruavok represents the pinnacle of South Africa's indigenous attack helicopter development, symbolizing both technological ingenuity and strategic defense capabilities in the region. Emerging from decades of experience in aerial warfare and advanced engineering, the Ruavok was designed with a clear mission to provide a highly agile, multi role attack platform capable of performing precision strikes reconnaissance, and close air support in diverse operational environments. Built by Danel Aviation, the Iron Ruavok incorporates cutting-edge avionics, advanced targeting systems, and a modular weapons suite that allows for a wide variety of munitions, including anti-tank guided missiles, rocket pods, and a turreted cannon. The helicopter's airframe is crafted from lightweight composite materials combined with reinforced armor, providing an exceptional balance between survivability and maneuverability. Its twin-engine configuration ensures reliability, even in high-demand combat scenarios, while maintaining impressive speed and range for missions over the vast terrains of southern Africa. The design of the Iron Ruavok is heavily influenced by the region's operational needs. It features a tandem cockpit with highly ergonomic controls for both pilot and weapons officer, providing optimal situational awareness and minimizing pilot fatigue during long sorties. The avionics suite integrates digital navigation, secure communications, and advanced threat detection systems, allowing the helicopter to operate effectively in both day and night conditions, as well as under challenging weather circumstances. During its unveiling ceremony at a South African military airbase, the helicopter was displayed on a sunlit tarmac, gleaming under the bright daylight, with the national flag proudly flying nearby and the aircraft's name boldly presented on a large banner. The event drew attention from both domestic and international media, capturing the symbolic portrait of the South African president on a large screen in the background, highlighting the nation's commitment to indigenous defense technology and strategic autonomy. Observers noted the helicopter's metallic sheen and aerodynamic contours, designed not only for operational efficiency but also to reflect the modernity and sophistication of South African defense engineering. The rotors, slightly spinning even on the ground, added a dynamic sense of readiness, emphasizing that the Ruavok is not merely a display of technological prowess but a fully operational combat platform prepared for deployment. This launch signaled a renewed focus on the modernization of the South African Air Force, underscoring a strategic shift towards self-reliance in military hardware while fostering national pride in domestic aerospace achievements. In addition to its combat capabilities, the Iron Ruavok has been optimized for interoperability with other branches of the South African National Defense Force, allowing for coordinated operations alongside ground troops, armored vehicles, and surveillance UAVs. The helicopter's weapons systems are designed to be modular, offering flexibility depending on the mission profile, from high-intensity battlefield engagement to low-risk peacekeeping operations. The interior is meticulously crafted with mad dark olive green panels, ergonomic seating, and advanced multifunction displays that provide the crew with real-time data and tactical awareness. Every detail, from cockpit layout to engine design, reflects a focus on operational efficiency, survivability, and mission adaptability. The twin engines, reinforced with heat-suppressing exhausts and advanced turbine mechanics, ensure maximum thrust, reliability, and low infrared signature, making the aircraft difficult to detect in hostile environments. Its landing gear, reinforced for rugged terrain, allows rapid deployment in austere locations, a necessity given the diverse geography of the region, from savannas and deserts to coastal plains and mountainous zones. The Iron Ruavok also incorporates advanced defensive countermeasures, including radar warning receivers, missile approach alerts, and flare chaff dispensers, all integrated seamlessly to provide both automatic and manual defense options. From a strategic standpoint, the introduction of the Danel Iron Ruavok strengthens South Africa's regional deterrence posture, signaling to neighboring nations and potential adversaries that the country possesses advanced, homegrown aerial combat capabilities. Beyond military applications, the helicopter has also become a symbol of technological pride, representing decades of research, investment in local talent, and a commitment to developing aerospace competencies that rival those of much larger nations. During the unveiling, the ceremonial atmosphere was heightened by media coverage, photographers capturing every gleaming surface, and the subtle movement of rotor blades reflecting sunlight across the tarmac, all while military personnel ensured security and order. The design of the helicopter, while focused on function, also conveys an aesthetic of strength and precision, 
from the angular nose housing advanced targeting sensors to the sleek fuselage optimized for aerodynamic efficiency. The Iron Ruavok is a statement that South Africa not only values the protection of its airspace but is also capable of exporting advanced defense technology in the future, potentially serving as a platform for regional partnerships or collaborative defense programs. Its unveiling was met with widespread acclaim from military analysts, defense engineers, and the general public, who recognized it as a tangible product of domestic innovation and a testament to the nation's aerospace capabilities. Moreover, the Iron Ruavox integration with contemporary battlefield networks, satellite communications, and drone coordination ensures that it is not merely a standalone weapon system but a fully networked asset capable of enhancing operational awareness and strategic flexibility. In conclusion, the Danel Iron Ruavok attack helicopter embodies a fusion of advanced engineering, operational versatility, and symbolic national pride. Its gleaming metallic finish under the sun, the ceremonial presence of the national flag, and the symbolic portrait of the president during its unveiling all underscore its significance not just as a military asset but as a representation of South Africa's technological self-reliance, strategic foresight, and dedication to producing world-class defense platforms that are ready to meet the challenges of modern aerial warfare.